Welcome to Left Hand Lock Sport on the JM3, and this is the lock picking advent calendar number 29. Three more days left to pick in this thing. Uh, this has been in my life for about a month. It is still working just dandy. We uh, cut this lock on the intro video of this 30 for 30 lock picking edition, and we are doing this to promote lock sport grow the community and have fun while we're doing it. So progressively, we have been getting harder and harder starting off the month with one standard uh, pin in one chamber and we built it all the way up to day 18 where all of those were serrated. So now we're doing purely random with the code that you can find over here, just copy and paste into the compiler that is also linked into the video over here at the end of this video. And it chose for us yesterday, a standard serrated standard mushroom standard and mushroom. So uh, all of the security pins are in the correct places. So this might be a little bit challenging, although half of it is filled with standard pins. So let's get this thing all done up in a vise. Get this thing picked. Move on to the big three zero for tomorrow with another random bidding. So let's start off. You know what? Medium hook. And let's get a little bit of a zoom in here so we can see what we're doing. So uh, medium hook. Touch six, and it seems as though it got a little bit of a click. So five seems good. Four got a click. Three seems good. Two seems good. And one is good. So Move back down here. I uh, got another click off of six. Got a big click off six. Okay, so that might have been what we needed. Five still seems decent. Four is good. What's three doing here? Three, I got a click. I think that might have been an overset though. Yeah, all right, so let's check everything else. All right, loosening up. All right, I've definitely heard two things fall there. And three might have not been one of them. Five, four. I'm still not feeling three at all. So let's loosen up one more time. Move from the front to the back. We got one, two, uh, this three, four, five and six. All right, one, two, got to click off two, three, Five seems really stuck in there. <laughs> I had to drop everything to get five. All right, so one more time. One's good, two's good, three. Can't feel three. Okay, that means that I'm just gonna give up on this advice. It's not working out for me today. And do it by hand. Let's get this bottom of the keyway tensioner in here and do it up this way. 
Sometimes locks just want to be picked a specific way. I think this one wants to be held. So got to click off six. Five seems good. Four. I'm on my short hook here. Three seems good. Uh, two. I got a whole bunch of clicks. And one is good. Let's go back to two. Let's see if we set that all the way. Feels like it. Three's good. Four's good. Five's good. And six, I got a tiny click. Moving over to my medium hook so we can push that all the way up. Got another click. And is that where we want to be? Let's check the other pins. Two feels good. Three feels good. That was a slip. It wasn't a click. I slipped off that pin there. Five, I got a tiny click. And six definitely wants to be picked. But I got a click off of him. One still seems good. Two's good. Three got a click. Okay, now I think we're moving somewhere. Four, five, tiny click. And six. All right, got a major click off two. Three's good. Four's good. Five seems good. And six, five, four. Come on, something has to give. Three. And two. Two, that is the first time I saw two give way at the end. So major uh, change in the binding order from previous days on this uh, third to last pick. So let's gut this thing, um, see what's inside, and run the random lock generator for the second to last time. Be right back. All right, so we got all of our pins in there. So to the gutting. On pin one, we have our standard. Pin two, we have a serrated. Pin three, we have another standard. Pin four, we have a mushroom. Pin five is a standard. And pin six is a mushroom. And we filled the thing pretty much all the way up with uh, steels. There is a couple in there. I I'm looking inside, and I think two and three were our coppers from yesterday. But that is now in the past. Let's move on to the future. So, getting our random lock generator out here. We have this guy. So, go to this YouTube video. That's the one that's linked over here. We can grab the code and uh, the compiler. Copy and paste, you know the drill by now. Type in your stuff over here. I should know the drill by now. It needs manual focus for this. Okay, so type in your stuff between the comments or the quotations and uh, hit run on your compiler and you'll get a completely random lock. So steel, serrated, steel, standard, steel, serrated, copper spool, Steel mushroom and copper spool. Only one standard in this bunch. This one looks like it could be fun. So I will be back on day three, zero, two. Pick this thing and 
uh, get our random number or random lock generator out for the very last time. So I'm hoping you're liking these videos. I'm hoping you're liking this month. If you are, click like, subscribe, and uh, hit the notification bell. Every time I release a new video, you'll be notified and you can share the lock picking fun with me. So until tomorrow, peace. Oh,